And this is the energy vibration reading for all the Virgos people out there who are having birthday. Uh, it is a week from water. It is the week from the moon. So um, this week will open up to you uh, and let you see all the people and the block energies that have been blocking you. It is a week of emotion and a lot of emotions because endings will be happening in this week. And it is the color of white. Um, it's a week of illusions for a lot of people. It's it's a completion. It's ending. But a com uh, accomplishments which are very, very good. As we look at the energy um, uh, on Monday, there is the energy vibration of um, um, the Aerophant. And whenever the Aerophant is here, it's always talking about a group of people who you have to deal with. But this is good news because these group of people are going to help you because they're bringing to you... Um, an energy of helping you to see um, to see that um, you are going to be successful in whatever you're trying to accomplish, and you see well um, an optimism for the future, which is extremely good. The energy that is here for um, Tuesday is the energy of um, the lovers. And there's going to be a situation with you and a loved one in your life. And you're going to um, make a decision whether or not you stay in this relationship or you're going to move out of this relationship. On Wednesday, it's a very good energy coming in from the chariot. And the chariot is here. And it's um, actually here um, ending a cycle in your life and helping you to move away from all that was blocking you because um, good things are coming up. So on Wednesday, expect that something is going to um, come to an end. And this is like people who were blocking you, situations that you weren't um, been able and obstacles that you weren't being able um, to, to get over are going to um, move away from you. I love this energy for you guys who are having birthdays because the energy of uh, strength comes in on Thursday and strength bring uh, a group of people, organization. You're going to be out, uh, um, invited out for something and these people are going to give you the strength and energy um, to, to move forward. On Friday, the energy of the um, hermit comes up and the energy of the hermit is saying to you, look within because something isn't correct and there is someone or some people around you there is a, um, a, a sense and an energy vibration of someone stealing from you or someone not being honest to you so on Friday you will um, have that energy vibration of uh, uh, you start to look within and, and see what was going on and then you're going to find out that something isn't correct, that something has been stolen from you or people have been not being honest to you. As we look at the weekend on Saturday, the energy of something is going to come to an end and the sun is going to come out. And this is so very good for you guys because the, it's a lot of endings and new things and new experience are coming in. As we look at Sunday, Sunday have the energy of judgment and um, the energy of judgment comes for a man. If there's a man in your life he is going to get a very good message um, and if you are a man there is going to be a situation that is going to come that has to, to do with your relationship and you're going to because um, you were thinking about it on Tuesday and something this energy is going to come to an end because you get a message and the, the message is judgment so um, you're going to realize that uh, um, this relationship no longer serve you and you're going to make a decision. And in any case, the overall energy for you guys, it is um, you have trustworthy people around you and this is good. The energy of the week, as I said, is the moon. And in this week, you will see all of the people and the situation that's were blocking you. And um, the earthly energy of justice is here, which is uh, the overall energy for this week. Uh, and um, this is showing that uh, whatever had happened, whatever injustice that was placed to you will be balanced in this week because you see all these, uh, the death energy is here and you realize that someone was not being, uh, was not vibrating on the higher vibration with you and that energy comes out, which is so 
extremely good but you have trustworthy people around you that you can trust and um, this is a wonderful birthday cycles for you um virgos out there and this is good for you guys because um the situation that you have been in is going to come to an end and i want to say stay tuned for the general readings Generally reading for the week number 36. Okay, the year is going so fast. This is second week. Okay, the first energy that I have is from the Oracle and she says, come to the edge. And this is so true because sometime in all of us lives, we have come to the edge where situations have brought us so down and people are, are so negative and people try to block you in every situation. And sometimes you've just come to the end in, um, at, a, at, at the point in your life that you think, how can I um, go further with this sort of energy around me? And whenever you reach to that, um, point in your life when you have reached that point when you have really come to the edge and you think to here and no further and this is when you really say to yourself i am not letting this happen to me to here and no further i don't accept this energy and you try either to move away from these people or you just ignore them and the best thing to do is to ignore people who are vibrating with a lower energy vibration okay um, uh, coming to the edge, each and every one of us have had it in our lives when we try to get situations balanced in our life when injustice has been done to us. And I can tell you as a person, just walk away from it. Whenever you feel that you have reached the point that you have come to the edge, do not go over. There's a thin line. Do not let people because of their negative energies and how they will deal with you, make you um, go over that line to total madness, total shutdown, total close down. Don't do it. Stand up and said, this is how far you come. And I'm, may, I'm putting a stoppage to it. The next energy that we have is the energy form the the, the um, number 36 energy and it is the energy from the second chakras and when the second chakras come in that second chakras is um all about your base chakra it is the energy vibration of the base chakra and i want to say to you people is that it is time to um, start touching and healing your base chakra. Start touching, healing your base chakra. Make sure you can clear the energies of all the negative things that are going on around you, okay? And by doing that, you will cleanse and clear the energy of your body. As we move on and we're looking at the energy vibration of... Um, the, the another card and it is the river queen and i love the river queen she is um the river queen is here and you know why i love the river queen so much is that she bring you in the flow of life she comes and she says to you let go and when you let go she nurtures you and she helps you along with the movement in your life but she helps you to flow in a higher vibration level and in the beginning, the first card was come to the end. And whenever you've reached that stage, the river queen, she will come in to support you and to guide you up and higher vibration up and a higher positive level in your life and move you away from all these people who have been blocking you and all these energies and these people who have let you come to the end. Okay. As we move on, we're looking at the energies from, um, the um the 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 last card and it says commit commit and whenever commitment comes up is that the universe is saying to you you know you have gone through a situation that you have come to a point in your life that you feel as if you have been to the edge but guess what the universe and the angels is here your angels and guides are always support you and they never they know exactly what you came to this planet for and they never let you fall okay and whenever um 
um the 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 um the river queen comes she is helping you to get the flow get yourself in the flow of life find your divine life purpose and um by that doing then when you commit to that you will understand because you make a commitment to your divine life purpose and then the universe is just going to send people in your life to bless you and support you on your journeys forward i want to say to everyone out there everyone has a time in their life when they think wow I am at my last Latin <laughs> but you know you just look at it and said you know I am not going to let anyone push me over the ledge and you stand up and you connect with yourself and I want to say thank you for being here thank you for being here with this wonderful week and namaste